Ever wondered what it would feel like to be born to the pair of Andre Agassi and Steph Graf? Growing up in your parents' shadows and having to live up to the expectations of their fans worldwide could be tiring and frustrating. However, you won't have to feel this pressure so much if your father says something like, if I went back in time, I would probably retire sooner. The thought of tennis without the legendary rivalry of Agassi and Sampras would have been devastating. In this video, we will be bringing you the secrets about Andre Agassi's kids, telling you what drives their decision to pursue a career different from that of their parents. This, coupled with Agassi and Steph's approach to the choices their children have made and how they feel this will impact their legacy. Andre Agassi once revealed in an interview that being a parent is my greatest joy and raising our two kids is our biggest joy and our biggest worry in many ways. What kind of ways? We'll bring you that and more in this video, so sit tight and relax as we bring to you the secrets that lie deep in the house of Andre Agassi. Andre Agassi, aka The Punisher, is an American professional tennis player. He is a former world number one and an eight-time Grand Slam winner. Aside from his wonderful career as a tennis player, Agassi is also a businessman and a philanthropist. Agassi once said in an interview, that the hardest win of his career is his wife, Steph Graf. This is understandable, seeing as Steph Graf is also a professional tennis player like her husband. However, unlike her husband, she has a record 22 Grand Slam titles and has been ranked world number one for a record 377 weeks. Having to capture the heart of an astonishing lady such as Steph would have proven to be a challenge for him. In his book titled Open, Andre narrates how he was thunderstruck on seeing Steph for the first time and how she kept ignoring his advances until he had to go all out. Guess it was worth it since the couple are now regarded as a power couple in the world of tennis and now have two beautiful kids to continue their legacy. At least that's what we thought. The children of Andre Agassi and Steph Graf have shown almost no interest in the sport with their first son Jaden choosing to play baseball and their daughter Jazz L choosing to dance hip hop. It will be safe to say the children have refused to dance to the tune of their parents. However, unlike Andre Agassi's father, Emmanuel Agassi, he has chosen to let his children do what they want without having to force them to live up to a legacy he despises. In his book, Andre recounts how his father forced him into the game of tennis, writing, my father yells everything twice, sometimes three times, sometimes ten. Harder, he says, harder. Hit earlier. Damn it, Andre, hit earlier. Crowd the ball, crowd the ball. Now he's crowding me. He's yelling. It's not enough to hit everything the dragon fires at me. Now, this dragon was a ball machine Andre's father had built when he was seven years old to teach him how to hit balls earlier and faster. When Andre recounts these experiences, he refuses to allow his children to experience the same. Before we go any further, we should meet the Agassi kids, starting with Jaden Gill Agassi. Jaden Gill Agassi was born on the 26th of October 2001 in Las Vegas, Nevada. He was born just four days after his parents got married at his father's Las Vegas home with just their mothers in attendance. His names are extracts from his parents' personal life, with his first name being derived from the masculine variant of Jade, which is a word his mother liked. His middle name, Gil, happens to be the name of his father's trainer, Gil Reyes. Despite being born into a family of outstanding tennis players, Jaden was never forced by his parents to follow in their footsteps. Truthfully, Andre and Steph seemed to have had enough of tennis, which took a larger part of their life while growing up. They weren't ready to introduce their children to a sport they have grown to despise even after the fame and glory they experienced. Jaden had the opportunity to try his hands and his feet on a couple of other sports before finally settling for baseball. In an interview, Andre once said Jaden had picked up a baseball when he was five years old and has not let it go ever since. As a baseball player, Jaden plays competitive baseball for the Las Vegas recruits and very quickly proved himself to be a top player. Jaden also plays for the Trojans of the University of Southern California. It's safe to say Jaden inherited his athletic genes from his parents. He is known for his extraordinary hand-eye coordination and his ability to hit home runs. So far, Jaden has been honored with four Most Valuable Player Awards, quite impressive for the youngster who hopes to compete in Major League Baseball soon enough. 
with his current form and exceptional talent, that wouldn't be a problem. Although, the only problem is that Jaden is still recovering from the consequences of an elbow operation in 2019. The prognosis is good, and the healing process takes about a year, but now that it's been over three years already, nothing should stand in his way. However, the road to success would be easier for Jaden if he can just ride on the influence of his parents in the world of sports. The youngster chooses to attain success on his own probably why he chose not to play the game of tennis, since there would be immense pressure on the youngster to outperform his folks. Even as a baseball player, Jaden has chosen not to have the name Agassi written on his jersey and has chosen to go with the name Rock, because he doesn't want to have to feel the pressure of living up to his name while trying to enjoy the game he loves. Even though we know that the name will still have a certain impact on his life, Jaden enjoys a good relationship with his sister Jazz, whom he loves so much. Speaking of the Agassi princess, Jazz L. Agassi is the second child of Andre and Steph. She was born on the 23rd of October 2003. Unlike her brother, she plays tennis sometimes and is more passionate about the sport. She spent some time playing it and could probably try out in the future. For now, Jazz is more focused on her studies. She is active on Instagram with over 13,000 followers and just five posts so far. She continues to keep her personal life away from the media, so it is unknown if she is in a relationship or not. Hopefully, we will get to see her take after her mother on the tennis court. When asked in an interview if he would like his kids to follow him into tennis, Andre replied saying, We want them to make their own choices and would never have said no to what they were, but we didn't go out of our way to expose them to tennis. Our prayer was not tennis. At some point, they knew we did it and they tried it. They saw behind the curtains and they know the demons that are involved. I don't know whether that influenced their decision not to be a part of tennis, but we were pretty thankful they weren't interested. Really, pretty thankful. For Steph, in an interview with Hello, she was asked about her children and how sporty they are, and she had this to say, They're very active. Very active. They're keeping us very busy. They're really into sports. Our older one plays baseball and it's a lot of fun. He plays more baseball tournaments than we play tennis tournaments when we were young. In America, they have a lot of organized sports for baseball, football, and other big sports. They've got a kind of community. They have a lot of leagues. He did try soccer first. He tried one season, but didn't like the contact of it. Proud words from a proud mother. The couple rendered an interview to Stellar Magazine about their approach to parenting and they said, we just wanted our children to choose as they see fit and to then make sure their days reflect the things they claim to care about because doing something a little is not the deal. Andre and Steph have proven time and time again how they love their kids. Their open-minded approach to the career choices of their children have proven how selfless they are and how much of a better person their children have made them to be. Andre never fails to recount his challenges growing up as a kid with nothing but tennis to keep him company. At intervals, he had always described tennis as a lonely sport and has said he regretted playing the game. Being forced into a career never goes well for a kid who wants to be free to make his own choices and strive for them with the support of his parents. Andre and Steph have come to understand that all they need to give their children, in addition to love and care, is support. Hopefully, we get to see the Agassiz kids do great things in the future and thrive exceptionally in whatever field they settle on. In an interview, Andre talked about his son, saying, I'm really proud of who he is. He was always a measure twice, cut once kind of a kid. He would size up his engagements. He's learned how to earn his own path, and he'll go the extra mile to do that. He went on to say, I'm just proud of him. He doesn't have to be great for me to enjoy watching him play.